Hey everyone, I'm Jake, the DM for Venture Ventures, Baldur's Gate Descent into Avernus. And before we get started, let me do a quick recap. We are still in hell. Uh, and for the foreseeable future, we in will be game, in hell. In the game. In the yeah, game. What, yeah. 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 That, just yeah. checking. Um, I was just about to go down a whole, a whole uh, comparison. But uh, previously, last episode, this is episode 30, by the way, guys. Episode 30, it means nothing. It's just a number. It's a nice round number, though. On the last episode, episode 29, uh, we talked to Archon the Cruel and uh, decided to, um, we had the, the group get contacted by an extra planar being telepathically uh, because they couldn't wrangle and handle and hang on to a unicorn that they were going to give to Archon to receive a vial of Tiamat's blood. Uh, and that that extra planar being made them an offer they couldn't refuse, really, in the situation they were in. Uh, and in order to save Lulu's life, they really needed to accept it, and so they did, uh, giving up the vague notion of fortune in the exchange. Uh, the extra planar being provided a unicorn on the spot right in front of Archon, who accepted and replenished his uh, necrotizing flesh with the unicorn, killing it. Uh, and before they left, they had a little a little rumble for fun against Archon the Cruel and his his bodyguard uh, Torgar Steelfist, the Minotaur, and couple people were went did anyone go down i don't remember uh one person cool yeah i went i went down okay two people went down we but it wasn't to the death so it's all in good fun uh and then made the exchange and they went on their way heading to uh, presumably heading back to old drac uh the site of the fallen titan and that's where we left off, just outside of Archon's Tower. You guys were going to long rest, I believe. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you long rested. No issues. Good to go. Man, did and... you, guys, you guys see, like, yesterday, I was really I was really taking it to, um, not to Urgar, uh, Aldark, what's his name? Archon. Uh, Archon. I was really taking it to Archon. He was surprised a couple times. Like, yeah, bro. like he, whoa, he just, that mall. They were strong, man. I'm, I'm glad we held our own against those guys. Yeah, I saw that armor and said, fuck that. I'm just going to hit the thing that my sword can, you know, cut. Yeah, that's so why I didn't shoot at Archon so, at all. So the respect, other guy had no respect. armor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it, uh, it was, uh, he hit really hard. I, uh, I wasn't expecting that. I mean, I should have. He was real big, but I thought yeah, that, I'd be able to that, dance out of the way. And I and that and, uh, dead arm thing, the dead arm thing that he did, man, that did not feel good. I do appreciate you that standing in front good. of him, Ollie. Thank you. I didn't get hit at oh, all. Yeah. Thanks to you. Yeah. Was, was, yeah, uh, I didn't get hit once either. It was pretty great. It was fun. Don't get me wrong. It was it was a blast dancing around him. It's it's what I like to do. Uh, but uh, yeah, it, it it was less fun when he connected. And with the horn, oh, did you hear when I called his mother a cow? Mm, yes, <laughs> that, that was, was hilarious. <laughs> I, I, he didn't seem to be right. too upset about it, though. Uh, I think he seemed real upset. He then jammed his horn into my stomach. <laughs> I think it worked. Anywho, anywho, uh, yeah, uh, ready we for drive. now have this vial. Yep. Where are we taking it? Uh, we got to take it back to Oldrac. Something about dousing it on a uh, on a fallen titan. Why do we need the titan? We need the titan's blood. Oh, oh. is the titan going to give us? I hope so. Here's the thing, right? I'm very worried about this. Because we couldn't beat those two, right? And they're mm -hmm. like pretty powerful beings. But they, they don't have the title of titan. 
No, um, but but Archon the Cruel has his own tower in Avernus, so that's a pretty big deal. Yeah, I feel but like. this dude had to be locked away and turned into something else because things were afraid of him, right? Is that what I'm getting? Yeah, but we'll be on the good side of things with the Titan because we're bringing Unless him Unless he just comes out in a rage. He's just been locked up as like a spine devil or some bullshit for God knows how long. He That's could come true. out swinging. He could also come out so big that we're so tiny he just won't notice if we nick his ankle, take some blood, and run. All right. And Titan, right? He's big, right? You would think. He's got bigger fish to fry. He's not going to worry about us. All right. He's got like Tiamat. Isn't that who, who fucked him up the first time? Probably. What if Tiamat gets mad at us for unleashing him? Using Tiamat can only get mad blood. at Archon the Cruel because Archon gave up the blood. So, right. bullet dodge as far as I'm concerned. Right. What's important is we're not the bad guys here. We're just... Right, Lulu? In between. We're not the bad guys here. We're doing Shut up. good... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Lulu. Sorry. Lulu, we saved you. What do you? Hey, Jerry, you were the you used to be the only good one, and then you lied to me. <laughs> did we? Uh, did I lie? Yes. But we. Did you dunk your head in the river sticks and forget? Ho hold on. What did Jarvis <gasps> do to ever upset Lulu? Many things. <laughs> I think, I think Lulu just realized something. <laughs> is that what happened to you? Is that how you, for, is that how you forgot things? You dunked Maybe your head I was the dunked in the river Styx. Can you undunk yourself? Like go to a different well, we, Can you unbaptize we yourself? We, 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 we were kind of doing that. My memory's getting jogged every once in a while. Yeah, but let's like jog at 100%. Well, maybe if we talk to Bell about it. They can help us. Oh, that's right. I was just about to ask the daisy chain of, of fetching we're doing and where we're going back to, but it's... We're trying to go to... We're bell. trying to give uh, uh, the Titan to, blood to we got to free the Dow because the Dow is going to give us the letter of recommendation. We got to run to talk to Bell. <laughs> we got to get, is... get on the crew team at USC. <laughs> oh, man, guys, we're getting real close. And then Bell... Is uh to hate Zeriel and she'll hopefully tell you where the <laughs> where the citadel that sprung up around the si so sword of Zeriel is. Bingo. We got uh, there. All right, everybody. Is power Zeriel, the power. Do we know if Zeriel's in this citadel? Like, what's the importance of the sword if Zeriel's not there? To jog Lulu's memory. Also, okay. Lulu, Lulu thought like that's the key to destroying Zeriel. Okay. Is there and saving Elturel and possibly saving Baldur's Gate. Got it. Noted. All right. It's fine. It's very confusing and convoluted. Heading to the Titan that is now a spine devil. Uh, I Where's the paper where I wrote that down? There it is. There it is. Uh, Pre-rolled for encounters. On your way there, you're fine, uh, as usual. And you make it to the cracked helm and sword of a titan half buried in the ash of Avernus. And uh, you see a spine devil mindlessly kind of bopping around the area. And when you pull up, it kind of jumps up and down and is looking at you guys expectantly. When you say the cracked helm and sword, what's the what's the size we're talking here? Huge. 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 Gotcha. Gotcha. U -G -E. <laughs> huge. 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 <laughs> he rolled uh, like this guy's gigantic. Yeah. Okay. Now, next question. What do we do with the blood? Get it. Is it a spell? Does it drink it? Do we pour it on it? Did it just talk? Give it! Yeah, holy shit, it talks. Is it talking? Is it saying that in common? Mm-hmm. Oh. Are, you, right. it. Are you Aldrac? Right. Yes. Yes. Tiamat cursed me. 
Oh, give it here, Matt. Give it. Oh, 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 hold on. Hold on. I'll give you my blood. How does that, this guy? That was yeah, amazing. Okay, cool. He immediately knew. Uh, didn't you guys already visit? No. No. Oh. Not this guy. Oh, yeah. I did my, my <laughs> changing of the story because I didn't want to add another two steps to this fucking question. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, he's telepathic, and he read our minds. Uh huh. Indeed. <laughs> um, you give it. I'm like, no, oh, yeah, okay. That's what we need. And I takes the vial and it, flick it to him. Just pours it on itself, and uh, you see it transform. Its flesh splitting as this medium creature turns into a, excuse me, small fiend grows and grows and grows before you into a huge ashen skinned empyrean like how big huge uh, 20 huge 20 <laughs> 25 feet tall has a 12 pack ripped as hell uh scars everywhere and uh has been doing those eight minute abs mm-hmm. and uh once it's done transforming it turns to you and says thank you i will give you my blood now and it oh you didn't take i'm glad thank you for not taking the orb of dragon kind from the sword i worried about that it's been a long time worry of mine since i was a young titan that somebody would steal this orb of dragon kind from the hilt of my sword and he pulls a sword up and uh, pretty without hesitation cuts across his hand and a gush of his blood starts pouring out. Uh, uh. I, I reach out with a vial and probably get like soaked up to the shoulder at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're soaked in this stuff. Doesn't feel or smell good. There's a, a, a little bit of a fetid sulfurous smell to it. Uh, which may be surprising coming from a Empyrean, but who knows what it turned into being down here for so long, trying to whip Tiamat's ass. Good luck. Who knows where it's been. Mm-hmm. And Uldrak says, I will travel back to Surtur now. Yeah. Okay. Well, Is Surtur a place or a person? To God, my father. What do you what do you think he's gonna say? My dad's always disappointed in me. I expect he'll be disappointed on me as well, since I didn't slay Tiamat. It's disappointing. Well, I've been leave, trying to if you leave that orb that you were talking about with us, maybe we can do it. You're going to have to explain how that would work to me, please. I, I don't know yet. I, I don't know what that orb does, but it seems like it'd be nifty. I probably shouldn't let you make a check on this, but it's going to be so fucking high <laughs> that, like, go ahead. It's possible. A persuasion check. Hey, he's... Ollie's full of tricks with the uh, the luck and whatnot. Uh, it's a 26. 26. <laughs> Not quite there. Uh, <laughs> can you get a 30 with your persuasion? If I rolled a nat 20, I could get a 30. Okay. I figured you could. Yep. Um, it, was in, it was in the realm. Yeah. Uh, he goes, well, I'll be going now. I don't know about that. My skin is pretty ashy down here. So uh, good luck with your dad. Just uh, don't forget. Maybe put in a good word if he's a god for like us restoring you. I don't know if he could give us any help with what word. Well, I gave you here. my blood. Yeah, yeah, and that's fucking Who, awesome. Who's god? Or I see your symbol. What guy? My eyes are still just. What symbol is that on? Is that helm? Yes, yes, that is helm. Oh well, fuck that. I hate that guy. Oh, oh you know him? I don't know him personally. Oh, my dad okay. does. He always talks shit about him at the dinner table. Do all gods talk shit about each other? Well, my dad's a big shit talker. I don't know about the others. 
Gotcha. Usually the good ones are high and mighty and are passive aggressive with their holiness and it gets real old. It's pretty transparent and it's yeah. Are you going to be a God someday? I hadn't thought that thought hadn't crossed my mind. What are your dad's thoughts on Azuth? Doesn't like him. Mm. <laughs> Do you think if you kill your dad, you'd become a god? That thought hadn't crossed my mind either. Oh, cool. Maybe, you should think about it. Maybe, maybe I've been concentrating my efforts in the wrong place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Look what you've done, Ollie. Hey. Old yeah, guy. maybe. If you ever become a god, just remember us because we gave What's you the your idea. names? The B I'm Squad. Rollercoast. Ollie Roller Drift. Coast. But yeah, the Bean oh. Squad is, is what we're collectively known as. Ollie. I am O'Kurth. O'Kurth. <laughs> Jarvis Silverspear. <laughs> Jarvis Silverspear. And just think what? if you become a god, you'll probably have like way better chance of, of defeating Tiamat. So. Yeah. It's, a, it's really a win win situation we're talking about here. I'm starting to think it's. Honestly, I'm starting to think it's it's not just about killing Tiamat. I mean, Asmodeus has her locked down here, so I think I'd have to kill Asmodeus too, which is... I mean, you'd have to work up to that, but yeah, ideally. Did you know that Asmodeus' true form is an infinite snake? Hmm. I can't say that I did. Did you get it to eat itself? I couldn't. I've never seen it. I'm just telling you what they taught us in elementary and Pyrian school. Just be an interesting visual. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how it already be eating itself. That's what makes it infinite. I I don't. That's above my pay grade. You should come again and find out. Yeah. Thank you for the blood, sir. Yeah, no problem. It's a long walk back. Well, see you later. Turn the trails. Hey, Ollie, for someone Boom. who likes keeping Boom. himself pretty clean, you look disgusting right now. Oh, good point. And I go about prestidigitating myself. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, where to now? Back to old Ralzala? Ralzala. Ralzala. Yep. Jerry's just journaling about the infinite snake and he like he's really perturbed by that. Trying to figure out how it works. He's just drawing it. All right. Uh huh. All right. On your way back to the demon zappa, uh, you find amongst the shifting plains of Avernus, you find yourself kind of getting slogged down in muck. <gasps> your your car is still moving through it. It's like getting swampy and uh, mushy ground, making a lot of thurping is the best word I could come up with for the noise it makes. You know, the <laughs> thurp. Yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Your car is still moving. Anything you guys would like to do? It's just moving slower. How are we uh, on fuel right now on souls? Very, very getting low. You want to throw um, another one in? Yeah, I'll throw one in. Okay. I've been driving, so I can I can feed it. Yep. As you put it in, you hear the the uh, screaming. Oh God! It burns. <laughs> And who, 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 who whose soul did you just use, Ollie? Um, someone burning. Rough death sounded like. Yeah, uh, Jarvis, you did a, I believe you did an Ar- Arcana check a long time ago on soul coins and learned that you could talk to them if you wanted. Oh, I don't remember. I that, recall. But I, will, I will remember that going forward now. Yeah. Uh, Anything you guys would like to do as the third thing? Um, looking about, how long does this muck seem to go on? Can I see an end? You don't really see an end, but that's 
it's not abnormal like your your visibility here is deceptive you, you because of the shifting of the planes and um yeah you don't know how long this goes on um do you guys want to back up and go around or trek through it as driving as as i'm going driving through it is there any like are there patches where it's better that I could try and yeah, feel and out? I assume you're already doing that. I just okay. uh, assume you're already, you know, that that area gotcha. over there looks less yeah. therpy. Yeah, you gotta get some um, some muddy tires, some muddy wheels. Yeah, that'd be a. Uh, the problem is I don't think we have any right now. <clears throat> so what? While we're driving, uh, Jarvis is going to be focusing on uh, another uh, casting find familiar since some thing totally destroyed my spider. And he's actually going to focus on um, his familiar is going to be a raven when he's done. Cool. Cool. Ah, come here. Go on. Um, I'm, I'm pretty worried about this car getting stuck pretty soon here. Do I have any spell? Get me here. I don't really have anything that could help with this. I don't either. Me neither. Okay. Uh, as you continue on, uh, make a survival check uh, to give us an idea of how well you're finding good places, good path through the uh, Therpy Swamp. It's a nat 20 for a 22. Hey, -oh. where was that on the be. persuasion? Mm -hmm. mm. Orb of dragon kind would be nice. Uh, Maybe I don't. I don't know what it does. Could <laughs> could, could backfire. Uh, it's nah, it's probably cool. pretty nice. <laughs> it's pretty cool. <laughs> um. Anyways, uh, yeah, you manage to pick your way through it, and you come out of it, and before you is the familiar. After a little bit of driving out of it, it before you is the familiar uh, ruins of the demon zapper. And as you approach the Tao, Ralzala appears and looks at you expectantly, similarly to Uldrek, how Uldrek looked. And Ralzala goes, Do you have it? Uh, yeah. Do you, do you have our payment? I do. And uh, appearing in her hand is a letter with infernal script on it uh, with sparkly red ink. And uh, well, and the money. I've, I've, I'm good for it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you've had good dealing so far. No reason to not have them now. Here's the blood. She takes it and looks at it and is kind of maybe a look of disappointment thinking it would be some you're breaking a pact with an archdevil. It should look more impressive. Drinks it and waits. And starts going to a part where the base of the demon zapper is. And Just kind of, in case you get incinerated first, can we have the letter? Oh, oh yeah, here. Hands and the, the letter and, and the money. <laughs> um, and is like testing the bounds, what you assume is previously with the boundaries, limitations of her agreement. And sure enough, she's able to get out of the... Progress further than she's ever been able to since the agreement and comes back over to you guys and says, thank you. I hope it wasn't too much of a hassle and you didn't have to go too far for it. Yeah, no, super easy. Titan blood. It's just willy nilly out here. Yeah, honestly, I'm a little surprised you hadn't already gotten it yourself, but glad we can. I can't. I can't. I couldn't leave. Remember? Yeah, but I mean, they're like diamond does, and you throw a rock, you hit a titan around here. Well, good. Then you, then you got a good deal. Yeah, it was a great deal. It really worked out well for us. <laughs> what did we negotiate? Was it four soul coins? Without looking at my notes, anybody know? 
Brian? That sounds right. Yep. I believe that's what it was. I'll replace the one that I fed into the thing. <clears throat> Dave, now's not the time for yoga. <laughs> eight minute abs, bro. Uh, where are the other ones going? Bag of holding? I've got two on me already, so. I've also got two. Only got one. Ollie, you might want to replenish yours since you spent them all driving. I'm now at two. I, re I, just, just, I replaced one, one for everybody. Just call it a day. Sure. Everybody gets another soul coin. How many does everybody have now? I'm at three. Two. Three. Ooh. I have two. Ooh. Ooh. By my calculations, I could buy 150 arrows. <laughs> I appreciate uh, the continuance of that, <laughs> that epic failure. Success in my mind. I, don't know what you're I have about. to look up something. I mean, you did get 50 arrows and your soul coin back, so I guess it was a success. I pretty much just got a free 50 euros. And I think I might have pissed her off and created a giant pyramid in the process. Was it then? Yeah, I think it was. Roughly I think I think day. I think I think there was a distraction was needed and I I thought what better than to create a giant pyramid while Rollicus was trying to get his soul coin back if I remember correctly. <laughs> What's uh everyone's constitution modifier? Plus 3. Plus two. Plus, Plus two. And the only one with three is the wizard? It's two with I have three. And what was your constitution again? I'm sorry. Jerry? Plus three. Okay. You're saying how many soul coins do you have? Yeah. Believe... Everyone's fine. Roly and you have three as well, right? Your yeah. conscience is growing heavy, everyone. You don't have any ill effects. So you are fine. Where would you like to go now with the letter of recommendation that you now have? Just I believe uh, Ralzala was also going to tell us that, tell us where to find Bell. Uh, yeah, Ralzala goes, uh, let me see your map. And she points to a picture of a large volcano in the distance and then points the direction and uh, hmm. got to yeah. hop, hop that river again. Yeah. We got more money this time, though. Mm, yeah. I guess we should keep this car because the other one's uh, beat to shit. Yeah, we need one of us learn, needs to like become a mechanic. I mean, you give me a set of tools, I, I can probably figure it out. Can't say I'll be much good, but I can figure out the tools a little bit at least. The armor plating on these things is just like scrap metal, right? Like all covering it. Infernal scrap metal. Infernal scrap metal. Next time we find some infernals, we should acquire some like nails and a hammer. And the next time we can <laughs> just come across some, just nail it to the outside. Yield. Isn't there like a greater mending spell or something like that? No. Oh, making stuff up. What about yeah. a greater welding. You weld maybe maybe work. your cantrip improved cantrip for mending. Maybe in later levels, that's what it. There's something called that. I don't, I don't think know. it does improve. I'm saying no, it's it's yeah. an added uh, the evolving cantrips. Yeah, the evolving cantrips. I'll double check it right now. Got this fucking song stuck in my head. What song is that? It's a Tame Impala song that. It's just the chorus and it you know how to get a song out of your head. Sorry, this isn't D D related, but to get a song out of your head. You get a different song stuck in your head. No. Uh you know like commercial jingles? 
uh, the one that gets any song out of your head, any earworm, is by Menon. By Menon. You just keep just doing that over and it goes away. I swear to God, it works every time for me. <laughs> there's also, there was a study on it that you you get it stuck in your head because there's part of it you can't remember generally. So oh, that's every song for me. Go and listen to it. It will get it unstuck. It'll if you can put that piece in. Yeah, I have a hard time hearing song lyrics, and I found out that uh, it's called Mondegreen is is the inability to hear correct song lyrics from songs. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyways, you guys heading out. It's the end of the day. You're gonna make it to Bell's Forge. You're gonna try to make it to Bell's Forge. Uh, it's pretty far distance so uh you're gonna need to camp somewhere uh if you'd like to look for a camp place someone make a survival check or if you'd just like to pitch it anywhere and just put up the bubble i think i mean if we could find something to hide the car behind and then bubble it looks like there's like a set of mountains like right before like we can cross that river maybe you're not going to be able to make it there. Um, Got it. In one, right, like right now, you're going to need to take a rest yeah, before. Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, I'll, I'll look for a better place to camp. Than just survival. Camp. Survival check. Still pretty good. That's a 19. Nice. Nice. Uh, yeah, you find uh, it's a on the outskirts of a swampy area. Uh there's a thicket of trees that you can look around and see nothing. Um, you put up the dome. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Who's doing watch? I'll take, I'll first. take a watch. Okay. You can take first. I'll take second. Make a perception check. First watch. I'll also take a watch as well because I don't, I can just sleep for, I can do my trance. 13 13 Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Remember that show? <laughs> <laughs> bow bow bow. You remember the song for it? <laughs> I remember the interludes. I don't remember the song for it. Man, that's just like crazy. every sitcom in the '90s. It was just like some guitar riff, and then. True. <laughs> Except Seinfeld, it was a bass. But <laughs> the 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 bass lines between uh, in interludes for Seinfeld are the best. They're so weird and just funky. Um, yeah. Uh, so a couple hours into your watch, uh, kind of surprising you, uh, Rolikos, you see two female drow approaching. I try to kick whoever's close to me awake. Uh, who? Time. We'll say it's uh, Jerry. <clears throat> Jerry. Uh, Jerry, people coming. Uh, infinite snake. Yeah. Uh. People coming. People coming, Jerry. Get up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. People? People. What kind of people? Uh, dark-skinned folk. Oh, no. Fuck. <laughs> 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 Two weeks in a row. <laughs> Are they not? What, he didn't say I mean, in some in some depictions, they're not. But yeah, m- a lot of them there they are. But I'm just laughing at <laughs> Dave saying, "Oh no!" <laughs> all of it, all of it, <laughs> too much. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to edit it. It's so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if Jerry is considered dark skin. It's gray skin, but like kind of darkish gray. 
I don't know, man. I, I really try not to think of interspecies relations and the subtleties of that in the forgotten realms. I try to keep my mind away from that. Uh, the dark hole. Okay. Dark, dark hole. Uh, so they approach and they're, they're, they don't have any weapons drawn. Um, they do have uh, weapons uh, and, and wearing leather armor. Uh, but they're just kind of standing and looking and kind of squinting. And I mean, they can't get What's up, in guys. The well, I'm assuming we have the dome up, right? Yeah, you do. And they wave. Oh, when Jerry, uh, uh, everyone hears that. And I'm just gonna say, Jarvis, can you tell me if Jarvis sound is goes sleeping? In or out? Oh, oh, yeah. No, uh, he heard Jerry. You okay. can tell me if he wakes up. Oh. Um, I don't think it says anything specific about sound, though. Uh, but he still can still be woken up, like it's uh, like he is sleeping, right? You know, I was just wondering if sound could go in and out of the dome. Oh, just, of the dome. I think yeah, it can yeah, go. Yeah. I think it can go out. I think it can. I just wanted to. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about it. it. Just says creatures can pass through it. Spells and other magical effects can't extend through the dome. The atmosphere is comfortable and dry. It doesn't say anything about it. Okay. Cool. Hello? Uh, do you have anything to eat? We're low on supplies. Just um, got out of this swamp. Yeah, we got stuff to eat. Sure. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> no, these people. Jerry. We're in hell. Hold on. <laughs> they could be trying to kill us. Uh, what are you? Who are you? I'm Rollercoast. Nice to meet you. My name is Ithanla. Okay, I'll just. And make this up is my. <laughs> this is this is my sister Yentra. You know, before what I said about the food, our food's real shitty. Um, All the food is shitty here, but it still provides nutrients, as far as we could tell, before we ran out of nutrients yeah got me there is this your how long machine? has it been since you've eaten oh, who knows time here is so weird um, is this your machine neck right here are you guys in some it's hard to see it's like a, a weird bubble in in the area it's just yeah, it's for our safety. Oh, yeah. Well, that makes sense. Um, how did you guys get to hell? You're sent. Did you go out of the dome or are you just talking through it? No, no. It? I'm talking okay. through it. I'm not leaving this thing. <laughs> we were sent to on a recon mission to uh, Swerf Neb Neblin uh, City in the Underdark and we got lost and we ran into some illithids and we ran and ran and I don't know where we must have crossed over in some sort of portal, but we wound up in the swamp and we've been trying to get out. <sighs> have you seen any vehicles? Yeah, yeah, um, your sink? vehicle. Sink. What? What? I'd like to inside check that story while I lay there pretending to still sleep because I'm annoyed that I'm woken up by talking. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the conversation. Twelve. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it seems Sincere. all those things are logically, they logically make sense. And yeah, she seems legit. My hat's pulled over my face, but underneath it, I'm still rolling my eyes and continue to be annoyed that I'm awake. Continue, Jerry. Sorry. Our vehicle, our machine was uh, like kind of sinking in the mud yesterday. yesterday. Uh, have you seen any vehicles sink in here? Mm, looks at her sister. I don't think we have uh, seen it come across your vehicle as the first one we've seen. It's quite interesting looking it's a 
it has a horseless carriage. Is that what it is? It's just a standard demon grinder, right? Is that what it is? Demon grinder. That's that's an impressive name. Do you... I hate to correct you there, Jerry. I'm pretty sure this one's a scavenger. Ah, uh, we had a demon grinder. This one's a scavenger. Hey, Ollie's awake. While they're ha- yeah. while they're having this conversation, I'm going to poof my raven outside of the bubble. Okay. Um, and uh, or if magic, because if magic can't pass through it, but I'm, it's, I'm not casting a spell. I'm just you're maintaining concentration uh, with the creature. Also, you can just tell your familiar to do something and report back to you. But can I? I guess my question is, can I? Because I can't have the creature leave the bubble because i didn't designate it as safe i guess technically um to be able to pass through in and out but can i with the way that the tiny hut works can i have the can i have it appear outside of the bubble still even though spells can't pass through or no am i kind of blocked inside um that's a good question what would be the purpose of popping it outside of the I just kind of want to have the raven like kind of fly around and see if there's anything else in the area that might have come with these two. Sure. Go ahead. Okay. So I'm just going to do that and have the raven kind of just fly around, do kind of like a perimeter check, maybe okay. go. Perception check for the raven, not you. Cool. Okay. S- seven. <laughs> uh, your raven returns and conveys what it saw. It's a swamp and it sees the two drow women. Cool. All right. Uh, back to my notes. Listen, was it Ithanla? Yes. Um, we don't have like an unlimited supply of food. I could give you some, but you realize you're in hell, right? It confirms it. Yeah. Yeah, no, you're definitely in hell. Sister, I don't know how we're going to get out of here. We don't know how we got in. I mean, you appeared in the swamp, right? Yes, yes. I mean, I don't want to send you guys back in there, but maybe you could get back out through the swamp. I don't know. It's a guess. Um, it's it's real rough out here. I'm not gonna lie to you. It it really sucks. Well, can we borrow your machine? No, it's our only one. Can we come with you? I'm going to tap your shoulder real quick and just indicate to, to buy some time and uh, I'm going to slink out like stealth through the thicket and like cut around your stealth um, out of the dome yeah okay uh, make out a stealth of the back out end the, dome. the opposite end yeah so, like, just come like... around behind or flank them I got an 18 on my stealth mm-hmm um, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna go all cat nippy. Uh, are they glowing? Any magic? Glowing magic there? Uh no. All right. Uh, well, yeah, I think they're telling the truth. I just shout from behind them. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, roller coast. Let's let's get some new adventuring. I check that they're. Um, like their uh, armor, leather under dark armor is glowing. Gotcha. Okay. Um, h- how are you guys in a fight? Because where we're going, there's bound to be a fight. Well, we. I know you were scouts. It seems. Yeah, we were not. We're, we're equipped for quick stealthy encounters 
Does anybody else have a issue? I mean, bringing them aboard. I can, and I cast message to Relicus. I you can, can just whisper. Oh yeah, I guess they right can't. Here. They're not that close, right? Yeah. Um, I can. I can I can see what their thoughts are, but I'd have to leave this dome and take the dome down to do it. If you guys, I can't I can't do it from in here. While you're having that conversation, I've already like strolled up behind the ladies and I'm like, "Yeah, hey, hi, I'm Ali. Nice to meet you." As you get within like ten feet, they turn around and go, "Oh, you're pretty good at stealthing too." Yeah, it's a hobby. Are you Tabaxi? We've never That'll seen anything like you, and they're kind of like scared of you. Uh, and um, I don't know, give me a pet. Come on, it's, it's real soft fur. I keep it really clean, even down here. Just scratch right there. That's the spot. We're okay. We don't want to touch you if that's no offense. Jerry runs out. And he's I just like, thought yeah. the backs do, but oh, yeah. Welcome aboard. And he like slaps him on the back. Hey. when you slap them on the back uh their form is solid uh and then your hand kind of sinks into it and their armor transforms into this yellow mucus like substance and they start melting before your eyes and, they well the two of them not the start, armor but they do the all of it starts melting and uh, let's roll initiative. As you see <laughs> <laughs> two piles of yellow oh, mucus we're gonna get some extra bodies in these battles with a, with a, uh, a single eye in the middle and, and their mouths are poking out of the various positions of the mucus and but it's still two yeah. separate ones. Yeah. They didn't like merge. Okay. So for this tiny hut thing, since this is the first time we've done a combat with it, they can all travel freely. I cannot, and I cannot cast spells through it. And when I leave the dome, it goes away. Can I, like, pop my wand out, cast a no. spell, and... Dang it! I tried. So I have to basically take this down if I want to do anything useful. You don't have to. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Jarvis, what's your initiative? Five. <laughs> Jerry? 18. Relicos. 19. Ollie. Also 19. Relicos goes first, I assume. Most likely. Uh, 17 decks. Yes, sir. And Lulu. Ah, we remembered Lulu. Mm hmm. A four. Uh, looks like Rollercoaster, you're up first. All right, I'll take my three attacks, all sharpshooter. The last one is the dread ambush. Okay, objects can't pass through the dome, you have to leave. I, I leave. Oh, okay, and get 30. I'll catch agility or grace, whatever it's called. I'll get 60 feet away. Okay. First attack. 16. Uh, uh, yes. Second attack is a 21 to hit. Yeah. Third attack is a 7. No. Great. Actually, with the way this works, the way it's read, creatures and objects within the dome when you cast a spell can move through it freely. Does that mean since his arrows were in the dome when I cast it, they can leave the dome? Uh, read it. Re and re are you reading the whole thing? It says uh, nine creatures of medium size or smaller can fit inside the dome with you. The spell fails if the area includes a larger creature or more than nine creatures and objects within the dome. When you cast the spell can move through it freely. All other creatures and objects are barred from passing through it. Spells and other magical effects cannot extend through the dome and can't be cast through it. Sure. Hmm. I already left. How much um. damage? 39 collective damage. And then bonus action spiritual weapon. 
Okay. How close? 60 feet is your whatever? Uh, 30 foot. 30. So, yeah. I'm just going to get it out there. Just so you're not going to cast it next to them. Oh, uh, well. Yeah. yeah. You're going to get within 30? No, no, no. No. Okay. I'm just going to cast it. It's like halfway between us. All right. right cool. All right. Ollie. Um. Jerry's right up there. If I'm playing with a 10 foot radius sphere, um, would I definitely catch Jerry and or myself in the effort of catching both of them? Yeah, 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 yeah. In that case, I will draw my sword and start swinging at on guard Ethalna. What okay. was Ethalna? Okay, might still be. Oh, that's garbage. Uh, 15. That was actually not as bad as I thought. That hits. And the second attack is uh, much better. Is a 23. Yeah. <clears throat> First attack uh, will be a defensive flourish. I didn't cast Hex. Uh, <laughs> we're good. Defensive flourish on this one. So normal die and defensive flourish die was a 4. Okay, so that's 12. 20 points on the first. Mm -hmm. Make sure I mark off my use of the inspiration. Second attack. 12 points on the second. Yep. And then I will bonus action. Um, really, my, my sword fighting was majestic. It was so fluid in, in how I drew the sword that Jerry standing next to me was so thoroughly impressed that he was inspired. Nice. You got a D8 inspiration, Jer. Damn. And I'm done. Nope. Okay. I'm going nope. to uh, run my ass back to the dome. Okay. All right. Thank, thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna run back in that dome. Uh, your def your defensive flourish doesn't give you like disengage or anything. No, it doesn't. Okay, just boost my AC. All right. Um... Gonna get an attack. Yep. I thought I might be leaving myself open for that. Um, 20? Uh, not with my defense flourish. Nice. I dance oh. around it. Dance, dance. This pseudopod like arm swings at you and misses. Cool. Jerry. Um, I'm ra I'm raging and, uh, using great weapon master using the mall. Are you hitting Jerry's, the same one they've been hitting? Yeah, and Jerry's just well, it's whatever one I I would I touched it, so yeah, they're standing next to each other, so it's up yeah. to you. I'm just and he's just screaming like, "Yeah, we can't get a break. We can't <laughs> get a freaking one more person to join our adventure party. Like everything sucks here. I hate this." And as he's swinging, <laughs> he gets a he the gets best a, break. He gets a uh, fourteen on the first. Nope. First swing? Okay. Nice. Uh, you get, say, 24. Second swing. Yes. And then I rolled damage already. Uh, 26. Nice. Anything else? Go back to where you go back to the swamp. <laughs> Nice. Almost cutting words. That was so good. Uh, it is now the Yochols, Yokulols turn, and they say the Spider Queen needs a sacrifice. And uh, Ithalia, the one you guys, you guys have been beating on, is going to uh melt further and turn into a yellow gold mist and 
That's not really melting then. What is it? Evaporating? Yeah, vaporizing. Vaporizing. Good call. Uh, thanks for checking me on that. That was super needed. <laughs> <laughs> Way to be a jerk, man. <laughs> Listen, I'm a jerk sometimes too. It's fine. <laughs> uh, okay. Actually, uh, Ithalia uh, is the mist, and um, it's kind of all around you, Jerry. And is it going to make me uh, shoot my family? And then no, that's coming next. Hopefully. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, the other yucklol, yucklol, is going to cast uh, innate spell. Cast a I need a wisdom save from you there, Jerry. Oh, can I? No. Can I? Oh, I can't counter spell it from in here. But can I, I can got, I counter spell? Oh, I got that a always, inspiration, right? I can, can never use, use counter spell ever. Something always stops me. <laughs> I can use uh, I can use that D eight, right? Yes. Yay! Inspiration's getting used. So it's ten plus. There's my D8. Can I give him player inspiration for using his bardic inspiration? <laughs> no, but but as you um, as you roll okay. that inspiration, your mind flashes back to that voice, that laughing voice. Me you hear it again, Holly. you, you, Jerry. You hear it again. <laughs> You find yourself distracted for a second as you felt this effect of this creature overtaking you. You're focusing on it and trying to shrug it off. And this voice just distracts you. And uh, you hear the laugh and it says, your fortune is mine. And you don't get the effect of the bardic inspiration. Uh, oh. so, so I roll. I roll a 10 then. Ten, uh, you are dominated oh. by this thing. Oh, he is going to shoot his family. That's good luck, guys. That's that's that's. That a means fun that spell. I start attacking them. That's a fun spell. <laughs> Maybe we'll find out. <laughs> we'll find out. Uh, while but you're basically um charmed, and uh. He gets to cast run commands against you. Yeah, so while you're charmed, you have a telepathic link with it. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Anything else I need to tell you? Uh... Okay. Basically, Jerry, uh, you'll just do what the yuck lol says until I tell you otherwise. <laughs> Good luck, guys. <laughs> I, I'm just gonna. It's say. always it's it's very fun for a DM to when there's a, a barbarian in the party to take control of a barbarian and just watch people <laughs> scatter. <laughs> Run away! Oh shit! Oh sh. Okay. Yep. 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 Yeah, it can go into our dome. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> That Come was on. the X. Yeah, was the X. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I really well, wish I could. One have... of you real, realized Brian that first. Brian and I first. had a full conversation with those yeps. We both knew. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, Jarvis. Does Jarvis up. know that? Does Jarvis know anything that just happened yet? Or it's, it's he hasn't shown anything yet that he's being controlled? Mm. Yeah, that sucks. Okay. You got it, Ollie! And I cast haste on him from since he's inside this oh, thing. <laughs> and I'm not leaving, and I'm sa- I'm going to shout, I can't leave! And uh, that is my turn. Uh, oh, but I am going to get up because I was prone, technically. Okay. You're standing in the middle yep. of the dome. Sounds yep. good. Yep. Lulu's turn, and she goes, well, I'm not going to go out there either. Huh. 
Oh, I didn't realize she was in there with me. Well, Ollie got it. Don't worry, guys. I got it out here. I don't think I can Jerry's use my trumpet without hitting Jerry. Just leave and come back. Jerry can take it. <laughs> Jerry's doesn't affect Jerry. She's not going to uh, use her trumpet. I thought she knew it didn't affect Jerry. Why doesn't it? Oh, he's one of them doesn't. Good. No, but he's it's the only so... one it doesn't affect. Who does it? it there was one it, of them that was Jerry baseball. neutral or good? I'm lost. Good, the question. Only good, good I, I, question. It's been like 20 episodes since I've been asked that. Uh, how do we look that up on the player sheet? It's on the description, description? tab under alignment characteristics. Chaotic neutral. My neutral. Oops. No, I think we're all neutral. Yeah, I'm. I'm neutral. chaotic. Wait, no, I'm. I'm good now. I was neutral. <laughs> oh, alignment, you, you silly fickle. dog. You fickle <laughs> beast. Uh, yeah, Lulu is worried about hitting Jerry because the only one that can reach is the blasting. I'm gonna go ahead and change that to chaotic neutral. Cause let's be real, I'm not. <laughs> All right. Roller coaster. Uh I'm going to take two shots at the one that is not a miss. Okay. Sharpshooter. 14? No. 19. Yes. I can't wait. I can't wait to play with Jerry. It's no, I haven't cast my mage armor yet. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Is it actually? Oh, we'll get. To... Go ahead. <laughs> my turn's coming up. Uh... Uh, um, how much damage? I'm sorry. Twenty-one. Okay. Um, and then I will move my thing twenty feet closer, so we should be ten feet away now. My spiritual weapon. And, uh, fuck it. I'm going to back up another 30 feet. I can get okay. so far and still shoot these things. <laughs> True. Uh, all right. Is that it? That's it. Okay, Ollie. Um, I'll juiced up on this haste. Um, I pop out of the, the dome. Um, and it really, you being dominated doesn't change what I was going to do at all um but i take my sword and i smack it against my armor and cast shatter at fourth level on whatever i can hit in that 10 foot radius okay. uh, which i assume is jerry and both of them if a mist is susceptible to thunder damage from shatter. yeah you can hit all three of them so they all need constitution saving throws jerry make a constitution saving throw is dominate a con uh concentration spell i don't know that's why I was like, I don't want to see, see if my 20. turn affects this at all. <laughs> nice, Jer. <laughs> With your that's, super that's, constitution. Yeah, that's when I get the... <laughs> one uh, saves and one doesn't. Okay, so on that one, it's four, eight, seven, 15 points of thunder damage. Okay. On that one. And then the it's halved if they made the save? It halved if they make the save, correct. So then do I have it again? Yes. Yes. All right. So, um, sorry, what was it, 17 you said? It was 15. Okay. Halved and then halved. So, so you take three. Like three, three points of damage. <laughs> yeah. And oh, I wasn't planning on hurting you anyway. That wasn't yeah, the plan. That's cool. <laughs> that's Jersey. why I'm doing this spell. <laughs> Um, Jerry, make and... another wisdom save. Oh, okay. sweet. Oh, come on. And I'm assuming I can't, the inspiration is gone now, right? Oh, it's evaporated, yep. sir. Yep, you have used it. 12. You are still dominated. I assume that. Yeah. Does the creature have to roll con checks? Uh, you don't know. Damn. And then, um, 
my bonus action was do while I was doing this, I called out to Rollercoast to watch me do this. Um, and you're feeling pretty juiced up yourself, Mr. Uh, Rollercoast. You have inspiration now as well. And then my hasted action is mm -hmm. I feel so juiced up that I smack the sword against the back of my armor and cast Shatter again on the exact same spot. So, Constitution <laughs> saves from all of them again. Fourth level again. Same deal. One saves, and one doesn't. What is the uh, save? Uh, 15. Ah, uh, 16. So now it is... Let me make sure I roll that right. Yeah, it's just 48. 21 points of damage. Okay. So have to 10, have to 5 for you. Pretty good. And then make another wisdom uh, save, Jer. Ah, <sighs> damn it. 8. Okay. And then I dance back in the dome because I think it's safe. If Jarvis, <laughs> for spell casting, if Dominate Person, which is I'm assuming what you were casting, if Jar if it's a wizard spell and he doesn't have it, I assume if he doesn't have it in his spell book, he wouldn't recognize the somatic and verbal components of that, right? You didn't have see, to have it. It, well, you didn't see this creature use anything like that. Oh, okay. Innate spell casting doesn't require somatic and verbal components. Got it. Or material components. It's innate. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's about that. Jarvis is sad. Gary's sad. Jarvis has no idea. Yeah, correct. Uh, Jerry, I'd like you to run inside the dome raging <laughs> and <laughs> unleash all your attacks on the wizard. Oh, wow. Ooh, on the wizard. Jerry just doesn't, like doesn't, runs in there and he's just like the I'm so sorry. <laughs> can't can they do they know there's a wizard in there though with the with the thing being up? Because they can't see inside because it's only translucent out. So they don't Didn't know there's a talk? wizard in there. Didn't you talk? Uh I guess I did do a somatic uh verbal spell on on Ollie. Dang it! Arr! I did. You're right. Somebody had so to make like I cast it, I, I cast it haste and I would have he would have heard me cast. Do I just haste. do the same attacks like I'm gonna do great weapon master even though I'm yep, dominated? Yep. Okay. Great weapon master. Uh what's the uh thing Reckless. that gives you advantage? Reckless. Reckless. I want all that. <laughs> so you're gonna you're gonna be efficient about it. I mean you have to be real. Um I got a uh you got a murder. You murdered him. <laughs> Don't even need to roll damage. I'm just making sure. Uh, yeah, so I got a 20. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unnatural. I'm going to cast shield now. Okay. That, does that put you above 20 or at 20? Uh, oh, wait. Uh, shield is only plus... I'm just kidding. I forgot. Uh, it's only a plus 5 in my C and I didn't cast Mage Armor. I'm not going to do that. Never mind. Because I'm, okay. I'm at a measly like 13 right now. What's your second? 24 damage. Okay, what's your second attack? Okay, so how much okay. damage? Twenty-four damage. Twenty-four for the first swing of the mall. As the mall crunches into oh, wizard sorry, bones. Sorry, dude. Twenty-one. <laughs> this is uh, such bullshit. <laughs> oh wow! And I rolled. I rolled maximum damage. Uh, <laughs> do you do more than thirty-four damage? Uh, it's... If you do more than 34 damage, I'm down. No, uh, 30, I think, is the maximum. So, yeah, 30 damage. Nice. Ah! <laughs> I am so sorry. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I feel strange. All right. You're going to get fucking banished. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, you only get two attacks, right, Jer? Yeah. Okay. Unless I, if I had taken him down to zero, I get a bonus. But okay. All right. Uh, <laughs> the it's now the Yucklol's turn. No. I, I oh wait, actually, I I have to I have to do a roll for haste. Yep. I was oh, is that what you're gonna say? Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And so, I don't have my transmuter, dude, because it's gone. You, you need so two, 12 you need... and 15 is the yeah. DC. Yeah. Yeah. And you need two rolls. Two okay. rolls. 
First you have to beat a 12, then you have to beat a 15. 16. 17. Cool. You are still hasted, my friend! You are not stunned. More important is I'm not stunned. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much, because that would be so bad. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I really hope I can, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the mist is going to... I don't think I can change that designation either. It's going to move to the other side of the dome, heading towards Relicos. Oh, if I go down, that dome goes down, Relicos too. Relicos is so far away, though, by now, right? Oh, yeah. I'm yeah. 90, 90 <laughs> feet away. Right oh, uh, yeah. It's just going to hang out around the dome, though. And... The... When I looked at the... When I saw this mist move, was it moving hastily or pretty slow? Uh, it was moving like a stiff breeze. Gotcha. <laughs> Being a DM, you have to come up with, uh, you, instead of getting, giving actually mechanical <laughs> shit, uh, you have to come up with stuff like that. Slower uh, than a sneeze, faster than a fart. Exactly. Exactly. All right. Wow. Good job, Jim. <laughs> that was artful it was uh, and this the non-mist yuckle is going to start making its way towards the car aww don't touch our car this is our good car <laughs> that's rude how rude <laughs> how rude and is going to Cast um, web between the dome and the car. You see a, a, a smattering of spider webs layer outside your dome. Oh, no. And it works for the spider queen? Oh, yeah. And Jarvis, it's your turn. Hey, Jerry. Yes? I banish you. Can I get a charisma save? I feel save strange. Of 15, please. A wisdom save? A charisma save, which I know I'm pretty sure you're terrible oh, yeah. at. Yeah, I'm minus something in charisma. Bye-bye. A -bye. minus one. <laughs> uh, yep. I got a two. Bye-bye. <laughs> uh, you're incapacitated, though, so you don't really... It's just like you feel like you just go to sleep. Um, so my body's still there? No. You're oh. definitely in another plane of existence. You don't realize where you... You don't, like, realize it. For five minutes or something? Uh, One minute. Of, oh, shit. So... Sorry, Kyra. There goes sorry, haste. sorry, Ollie. I just dropped haste. I had to. I feel like I had to. You feel your muscles tense up. Yeah. Is that correct? Is that what happens? Yeah. He stunned. he basically even if, you, even if you voluntarily drop it, I'm stunned. Um, that's a good I think, question. I can't remember. I think it probably still is. I think it is, no matter what. But let me double check. Uh, when, the like spell, when the spell ends, the target can't move or take actions until its next turn, as a wave of lethargy sweeps over it. Lethargy. I have to say, I think it was worth it. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll see. Yeah, no. yeah. We're good. I mean, yeah. I think it was, it was worth something. it because it was what you had to do. Because you made Jerry make multiple wisdom saves, and that could have broken the dominate person. It just happened to not. Uh, I think it was worth it. I just got the shit kicked out of me in like six seconds. Yeah, if so, you waited for, your, for my next turn, yeah, you'd, be, I, you'd be on the ground. Uh, yeah, hey, it's, it's all good. You, you acted on, you did something that you knew would work for you. <laughs> the alternative was relying on your teammates <laughs> to get you out of a bind, which are very valid options. Uh, I'm leave you high and dry, man. I wasn't going to do that to you. <laughs> I'm scared for my life, bro. <laughs> Uh, but bleeding everywhere. Sense. You did what you needed to do. Yeah. It's all good. I wonder how many rounds this fight would have to last for me to come back. Roz, what do you mean? Ten. 
Oh, yeah. I'm Holy shit, Roz. I I don't I'm going to that's all I'm going to say. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> well, just yep, no, say I, it out I, loud. I, I know what he said cuz I thought it too. <laughs> I was going to bring it up after. Say it out session. loud. So, by definition of the banishment spell. Yep. <laughs> Wait, did I just do something bad? Yeah. Jerry is now gone forever. Wait. Yep. Oh, because this isn't this isn't you're, the regular isn't plane. I go plane. I go back go to oh, plane of you just sent me back to uh, the material plane. Yeah. Wait, well, no, on only plane. isn't it only if that spell lasts the whole duration though? If the spell oh. ends before the one minute is right, passed, right, 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 it right, reappears right, in the yeah. space it left of the nearest unoccupied. So as long as it doesn't, our fight doesn't go on longer than a minute, and I draw like that other creature stays alive, he's fine. <laughs> Then you can bring him back. Yeah. There it's better only... not be a spider queen coming. <laughs> <laughs> now, if this fight lasts longer than a minute, we might have lost. <laughs> 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 yep. uh, Lulu is going to shoot her sparkles outside the dome. Wait, they can't shoot out, right? Spell effects don't go past the dome now. Burr, burr. It's blowing air with sparkles, maybe. I'm trying to make it work. It is a sound. And, and Jarvis would know that about a spell, so he'd be keep track, keeping track of time. He wouldn't want to kill Jerry. Well, he wouldn't well, kill him. Kill him. Just well, he wouldn't say he wouldn't get rid of him. him. He wouldn't get rid of him. He, <laughs> he actually know. might be pumped. <laughs> but like he's looking at us like huh. So Avernus is not the same plane? No. <laughs> I, just thought, I thought it might be the same plane of existence, just a different place. Yeah, planes, it's, yeah, it's a. But weird... technically, isn't he from the. the Material the city? Plane? The city we brought in, that is now in Avernus? Technically. From the plane, though. Oh, the yeah, that's true. Now in a different yeah. Plane. yeah, the that's city true. is not a plane itself. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Well, I won't leave you there, Jerry. Don't worry. <laughs> I can't All hear right. you. <laughs> I do need to keep track of that now, though. Just in case. Lulu uses her sparkles. And does terrible, barely any damage. <laughs> she trumpets out. Rollercoaster. Two attacks. On which one? The gas or uh, the, no, the other one? Slime one. Yep. Uh, 21. These are sharpshooter. Okay. And 18. Uh, yeah, both hit. Oh, and I can move the spiritual weapon actually in range now. Yep. That's a 10. No, it doesn't hit. All right. So 18 plus 18. 36 damage. Okay. That's the end of my turn. All right. I uh, was just double checking something. Uh, Ollie. Stunned. Oh, stunned, correct. Mobby. To the beginning of your next turn? Yep. Okay. Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> I need you to. Uh, Role play being hit in the other plane. Oh yeah, you're on ban you're banished shit. Um uh, okay, so it's this guy's turn. Did him going to another plane, would that have broken? I guess I wouldn't know that if it would have broken. You wouldn't know that. Yeah. But hey, your bubble's still up. It is, and I'm at four hit points. <laughs> yep, and guess who's not gonna heal you? Uh, the guy, <laughs> the guy that I uh, stunned to get rid of this other guy, and it's definitely all... not the guy that's ninety feet away. It's all good. There's no threat to me anymore. I am hiding in a bubble. 
All right. Until Jerry pops back into existence. Or until he does it to another person. The gas guy is going to go on the opposite side of the dome from Rollercoast. And the one that's not is going to make its way over to Rollercoast. And uh, check that. I'm going to do this. Um, I'm just sitting outside the dome like, wow, Jerry's been in there a really long time. (laughs) (laughs) You probably heard some like, oh, you heard a a popping noise when he disappeared. That could be anything. We're in hell. (laughs) This is true. Um, Burp, burp, burp. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to make sure I get this right. It's going to start the vehicle. Hmm. And start driving away. That's rude. Really wish I could have stopped that from happening. (laughs) Shut up! (laughs) It's like I put you to sleep. (laughs) <laughs> Almost like I was super fast and could have done two things at once very effectively. What's the movement speed of your vehicle? A hundred feet. Shit. Okay. Yup. Okay. <laughs> it's gonna... <laughs> What's that, uh, Ross? I just told Jarvis to haste me. I'll catch it. I can't haste you. <laughs> I can only cast haste like 60 feet, and if I cast haste, I drop banishment, and Jerry's back! Uh, yeah, it's gonna get, uh, it's gonna use a full movement to get far away. Jarvis? Mm. Jarvis can't really do anything without bringing Homeboy back. Um, I'm just gonna cast Mage Armor on myself. That's gonna be my turn. Okay. And I'm going to actually, uh, is it actually, bef- uh, scratch that. Um, I see this vehicle driving away. I'm what going, do you want to do? I'm going to tell my Raven to follow it. And, okay. uh, as soon as it stops and is stationary for, you know, uh, five minutes, 10 minutes to come back and report where it is. Okay. All right. Uh, Lulu's going to sparkle again. The gaseous one. Oh, that fails its saving throw. And... and I would have told it to stay out of sight, not, not like be obvious. Stealth it then. Yeah. It would be just a straight um, plus my decks on the Raven, right? For that? The Raven stack or the Raven stacks. Yeah, okay. What's with these sevens? Seven. 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 All right, the gaseous Yoklo goes down from the sparkles, from Lulu's sparkles. No yay, no nothing for Lulu. Come on. I said Jesus. something. Oh, my mic was muted. Yay, go Lulu. Fuck it. It was the slime one took our car, right? Yes. Okay. When you're banished, no one can hear you. Yay. <laughs> Roller coast. Okay. I didn't move last round. So my cat's grace recharges. Okay. So I am going to dash. And how the much, cat's grace. How much is that? 120 feet. Okay, you're still going to be behind it. Towards the vehicle. Am I within 90 feet of it? Yeah. I'm going to hunter's mark it so I can at least track it easier. Nice. And then that drops That's not my... concentration, right? Or is it, it is. It oh, is. Okay. So it'll drop my spiritual weapon. Um, and then can I see any part of the monster? Is any of it visible driving? I don't know how big From the this back, creature was. The, the way this vehicle with the 
uh, claw and everything. It's very, it's got a, a, a big ass. This oh, no, you know what? I dashed. I can't shoot. That's the end of my turn. Also that. Uh, okay, Ollie. Okay. Let me check one thing because it matters suddenly. Okay. Um, I'm going to... I'm in the dome. How far away did the car drive when it drove away? It drove 100 feet away. Okay. I'm going to felines grace myself as well. Okay. Uh, that gives me 60 feet. Okay. So I'm going to run that 60 feet. And then uh, I'm 40 feet away. That's actually closer than I thought I would be. But I'm still going to do the same thing. I am going to um, <clears throat> make pretty colors suddenly appear all around the car, but the only thing that can see it is the slime inside of it as I cast Hypnotic Pattern centered on the car. What does it uh, need to make? It needs to make a Wisdom saving throw. It's got pretty good saving throws. Bummer. That is a 12. That fails! Nice. What fail is, what save, the creature becomes charmed for the duration. While charmed by the spell, the creature is incapacitated and has a speed of zero. It's incapacitated. Mm. It's looking at the pretty colors. It basically sees what I see when I go all catnippy and see magic colors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Uh, that is pretty much everything i got okay so i'm concentrating on that all right skip jerry uh, that one's dead this one is incapacitated does it make a save at the end of its turn the uh, spell ends for an affected creature if it takes any damage or someone else uses an action to shake the creature out of its stupor no sir it does not okay uh all Third right level spell Jarvis. Um, Jarvis, did it go with out outside of 100 feet of the dome? The car? I forget how far you yeah, said it Yeah, basically. Okay. Yeah. So I would have lost vision on it. Um, I'm just going to sit here and keep concentrating on this banishment spell. That's it. Nice. Lulu's going to stick with you. Uh, Rollercoast. The car has stopped. It's like coming. It's not. It didn't oh, hit the brakes. Stop. It's like rolling. Yeah. It's doing a California rolling stop through a stop. Yep. Um, I'm going to look at Ollie and be like, because I saw him cast something at it, so I'm like, did you? Sure. What do we... And I'm going to hold... Don't hurt it! it. <laughs> okay, I'll get 30 feet closer, 60 feet closer to it, so that puts me within like 30 feet. Yeah. And hold... Well, no, that's it. Okay. I'm going to dash to get there. So that's it. Ollie. Um, I'm going to... Oh, shit. How far is away? What, I ran 60 feet before, so it's... It's like 40. 40. Still too far. Uh, <laughs> so I'm going to uh, run 30 feet, and then I guess I'll have to dash. Um, I'll dash to get on the vehicle. Okay. Um, and I guess I'll just have to poise myself to start stabby McStabbington it okay. next time. But I want to be on the vehicle. <laughs> mm -hmm. Easy enough. Yeah. Jerry's Spanish. You keeping track of this there, Gary? Mm hmm. Yep. Uh, for a minute, the yoke oil has the, the, uh, we is basically high. Yes. Okay. To one minute, as long as I concentrate. All right. And it Jarvis, hurt. In, anything in the uh, dome? Nope. Nope. Just chilling. Rollercoast. I will put away the bow. Get on to the vehicle. Okay. Draw my swords. Mm -hmm. And wait for all these go. You're gonna hold your action to attack one. Uh, of the yeah. It says two. Polly. I'm like, I just get this like really 
fucked up devilish grin as I look at Rollercoaster and just start stabbing. Okay. Make your attacks. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's uh, 24 21. on the first attack. Yep. Shit, it's a D6. 15 is the AC. I missed on the second, but I'm going to flourish on the first one that I hit. Use another flourish. Um, we're going to call this one, this is going to be a mobile flourish. Okay. Uh, green is going to be the flourish die. All right. Um, I shove it seven feet. Hopefully out of the driver's seat. Okay. Um, and I do damage to it. Yeah, I'm just trying to think how sure. <laughs> shove a slimy thing? Yeah, it's like... Uh, uh, sure. Hey, however you want to call it. Yeah. Uh, um, I also use my reaction to close the distance and jump down next to it. So if narratively I have to like shove my arm in it and it gets all like swooped in and I shove the whole thing off. Yeah, as Relicos is stabbing it. Sounds good. Um, but it does 13 points of damage as well. Okay. What I do 10 you? points of non-magical damage, if that matters. It does. And it instantly comes out of its trance? It is now out of its trance. Okay. All right. And I'm no longer concentrating. The spell is broken. Jerry's banished. That was it, right? Ollie? Yes, yes, yeah, that okay. was it. Boop, 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 boop. <sighs> it's going to slam attack Rollercoas. Um, was it? He's it was pushed away from me. Yeah. I guess it could pivot. Get closer and. Yeah. Oh, true, yeah. true, sure. It wasn't pushed that far. <laughs> Reasonable. <laughs> um, all right, let me roll these. Yeah, I rolled a really low, uh, really low on my D8. Okay. What's it? It's plus six, so 19 and uh, 25. They both hit. <laughs> And four bludgeoning damage and six bludgeoning damage, but uh, both as you get hit with it, you feel um, some of the effects of the slime uh, hit you, and that is. Holy crap. That's a lot of fireworks. Oh, well, that's four ones. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Almost uh, a time. <laughs> 13 poison damage from the first slam. <laughs> 24 on the second poison damage okay so it was 17 and then 30 damage it's for my concentration checks mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So one's 10 one's 15 uh say oh yep fail the first one so okay. hunter smart goes away all right jarvis same deal yep 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 Lulu's doing the same. It's your turn, Relicos. Um, that was unpleasant. So I am going to... That's a bonus action. I'm going to action disengage. Okay. And use... Anything else? Feline's Grace to get 60 feet away. Okay. That's it. That's it. Ollie. I'm sorry. Can I bonus action Hunter's Market again? 
Sure. Thanks. I'm going to uh, bonus action Hexblade's Curse it, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to attack it. Okay, do it. This encounter went uh, longer than is... I expected. Right. But it's a good one. It's a hit. We almost lost our car. That would have been bad. Uh, it's a 15, so that's a hit. So two hits. Yep. Um, last inspiration. Uh, it's going to be car. defensive. Okay. Uh, red is the die. So red's a five. It's uh, 16 points of damage on the first hit. AC boosted by five. Second hit. 19 points on the first. Sorry, I add three for Hexblade's Curse. Yep. And 13 for the second hit. Okay. Your your second hit uh, slashes through the slime and it loses its whatever uh, form it had before. It loses its, its... The only word that's coming to mind is stick to but that's not the word. But it's a sticky substance. Yeah. Uh, um, and it Viscosity? kind of... Viscosity? Yeah, the, yeah, sure. It's in the. It's better than stick to um, <laughs> <laughs> Although I guess you could say it. It's not no longer. Anyways, uh, the encounter's over. And Woo! can and we still count out? Dead. Can we still count out initiative for turn wise until my party returns? Just for the sake of I don't. <laughs> Jarvis doesn't know that this is over yet. So, and Gary doesn't know if. If uh, <laughs> if Dave <laughs> wants to roll up a new character or not, uh, for right. sure. <laughs> if you did want to roll up a new character, Jerry, this well, would be the opportunity. Let's just say this: <laughs> if, was the time. It, it's a sixth turn. If by the ninth turn, um, if by my ninth turn they did not come back, I would have dropped it regardless. We'll just fast forward. Okay. I think it would have so, taken us two turns. Yeah, yeah two yeah. turns. So uh, seventh, eighth. So you guys would have returned, and then I would have dropped. Uh, I would have seen you guys return, and then I would have dropped the banishment. Okay. I did get to suck some sweet, sweet life force out of that uh, slime, though. Nice. As it died. And then Jerry reappears! What am I? Am I still <laughs> no, dominated? No, not dominated. No, you're good. Whoa! What happened? Dude, that was not cool. You almost <laughs> killed me. Jerry, oh, so yeah, I remember that. It was like I was, I was watching myself in a dream. Where were you? Whoa. I was I was nowhere. Jarvis, what did you do to Jerry? I kind of sent him back home for a little bit. Um, okay, what did you do to me? Uh, so the way this <laughs> works is, you know how like I can make you stronger and feel better? Well, I kind yeah, of had was, to stop I focusing. Real, real high for the, for I had to stop there. focusing on you, and, and you just get really sluggish for a little bit. And I'm really sorry about oh. that, but dude, this Jerry almost killed me, man. I had to. Like, I had oh, no option. Yeah. That, that come down was rough. I had so many ideas uh, in my head. I was uh, going to solve Jerry. I was going to stop the car from you, getting stolen. You couldn't have done this all at the same time. Like, I don't, you're good, but I don't know if I I'm, trust you enough with my life. I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm still scared. Well... You still almost died, and we almost lost the car. <laughs> but I'm we did. I'm just gonna blanket statement. I, I don't know that I want that high. I'll stick to what Vlad's give me. <laughs> <laughs> Save that one for the other guys, maybe. Have you? Have I not hasted you before? As Ollie? No, nope. not where. Like, not uh, where I lost the haste in, <laughs> in battle. Yeah. Certainly not that, at least. And yeah. also, I don't think you hasted Ollie. I think you hasted other people. Got it. Something. So Jerry, let's let's not do that next time. Thanks, appreciate it. Now, I, guys, I'm, I'm I can't I'm guarantee that right now. Man. Like that thing just dominated me. I had no choice. Rollercoast, do you see this blood dripping out of me? Can you help? Can you, Bro, can you I am on, that one attack took me from <laughs> seventy life to twenty three. Oh wow! <laughs> I think we need. But to we're sleep. in the middle of long resting, right? Yeah, we only got like what an hour or two in. Yeah, so you start over. Yeah. Yeah, I so. can uh, I can stay up. I'm fine. Yeah, mm. I'm going to sleep now. I I'm going to bed. <laughs> You're a champ, Ollie. We we've we've got about if we got you would say an hour or two in, Jake. Yeah, but it resets. Well, I'm more worried about my. I guess I would recast my. I would drop my dome and recast it then because it's only yeah. good for eight hours. So I'll do that. 
Okay. Uh, so Ollie's taking a watch. Go ahead and make your perception check. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, that's ten. Okay. About two hours in, you see two female. <laughs> 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 Banish right, Jerry. Uh, whoever's closest to me, I kind of kick them away. <laughs> what do they look like? Uh, what what colors? Are... <laughs> uh, if you had to describe their skin tone, what would it be? Yes, we can we can make up for it, guys. I'd say it's like gray. <laughs> are they orcs? Yeah, you wake up, Jerry. Sure. Wait, wait, this is actually happening? This is, actually this is happening? A, we're, we're actually oh, doing this. Shit. Okay, we're actually doing this. <laughs> the same I don't, know, I don't, I don't wake up Jerry. Us. I don't wake yeah. up Jerry. I uh, I first go catnappy. I'm okay. sensing um, something in the orcosphere. Do they so, Rollercoaster, you didn't do any yep. he- healing exact to me same. before we went to bed? Fuck no, I thought we were oh, just going to sleep. Fuck! <laughs> well, and since I... you guys didn't tell me, I'm just assuming that the car is in the same position it was. I figured we would have drove it back. You did drive it back, but oh, I'm yeah, saying I'm like back. that spider web is that spider web still there? No, it's gone. Okay. God dang it. Um so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say to the thing like we already gave our sacrifice to the spider queen. Leave us alone. Just don't leave the dome. <laughs> Make a deception check. Don't leave the dome. <laughs> Please roll high. Our car's not in the dome. <laughs> oh yeah, God. It's too big for the dome. Just drive uh, the car away. 17. 17. All right. Let's let me check there. <laughs> Can't believe the same encounter is happening all over again. <sighs> What's in the swamp, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? I don't like it. Um, I also not, uh, Jerry's not helps, leaving the dome. I pressed. Oh wait, no. Can I do that? Never mind. That's thaumaturgy, not prestidigitation. We're good. Uh, you've, you've woken no one up at this point, right? Correct. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> rolled a, oh, a natural one and an eight. Uh, <laughs> and they go. Okay. Okay, what? Can we? <laughs> All of you did. Yep. <laughs> yeah, and we really want to sleep now. It's they been... turn to each other and start talking <laughs> in uh, abyssal, uh, kind of quietly. I, I speak abyssal. Uh, you hear words like they're talking <laughs> quietly, uh, and you hear words like. Well, what do we can't? I say in a bit, voices down, we're sleeping. Yeah, they keep their voices down, and we can't. Just trying to be annoying to them. We can't, we can't ask for a second in the same day. And then they just start walking off and uh, put up a hand, and it turns into a yellow slime and waves, and they keep walking Ugh. back into the. Uh, the uh swamp and uh what do you do do you just keep do you do anything i i walk out and i quietly fire up the car and I <laughs> drive it so that the driver's seat is in the dome okay <laughs> <laughs> I just inch it forward i like have to Ugh. i have to shove jerry over a little bit he yeah, yeah as he rolls over in his sleep a foot it takes you like to to do it carefully it probably takes you 15 minutes to like move yeah, people I have, I have and, to like, get yeah. out like look it's r- it's a, yeah it's a real <laughs> I'm gonna wake up you like a pain in the though? ass but yeah you're able to do it <laughs> <laughs> And uh, that's is... where we're going to leave it uh, tonight. That was great. Cool. Thanks, guys. Appreciate uh, it. That was, that that was, was fun. fun. That, that was, was a fun encounter. I'm glad that worked. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> no. yeah. <sighs> Who knows what will happen with your, your fortune? Yeah, right. Shit like that. Shit but... like that. Are we going to do this long rest now or no? Yeah, so we'll go today. over that with... Uh, 
with uh we'll do that next week okay okay who knows? Maybe more yuck lols will come out. No, I have four hit points. No more of those. <laughs> yuck lol. Uh, You're safe in here. Yeah, until uh, Jerry gets, uh, I don't know, commanded to attack me in it. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Maybe next time it'll be Rollercoast, and I'll shoot you from really far away. <laughs> and his arrows started out in it, so they could penetrate the border. <laughs> yep, he doesn't even have to come in the dome to hit you. Nope. And he has sharpshooter, and I would sharpshooter every time. And... Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. yep. <laughs> oh, that would suck. you just start picking us off one by one, and I couldn't banish him because he'd be so far away. He could heal the bad guys, too. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, that would be... Rollercoast getting... Also, would be bad one. Yeah, he just comes out of his dominate person. Everyone's dead except the <laughs> the yuck lols. What if arrows sticking out of him? <laughs> yeah, his arrows sticking out of everybody. Now in hell by himself. Um... Yeah, with some slimy ass yuck lols. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Uh, thank you, Jake. Yeah, let's thank do you. it again Good next times. week at seven p.m. Thanks for watching or listening wherever you are. Be good to yourself. Be excellent to others. Either way, uh, usually Both. I stick with good and good. We're excellent and excellent. I mix it up this time. Uh, and uh, yeah, Black Lives Matter, and we'll be back next week. See you later.